Well guys, you asked for another video on Dividend Kings, so here is another video on four Dividend Kings that have been paying and growing dividends consistently for over 55 years. And I think the one that has been grown that has been growing its dividend the least amount of years is 59 years on this list, guys. So yeah, we have four different stocks from four different sectors for you today. Remember on the last video I did, I asked for 30 likes. If I got 30 likes in three days, which was 10 likes a day, we would do a part two. And this is part two. So hope you enjoy. And guys, if you want a part three on this video, if we can get 50 likes in three days, then I'll do a part three on the Dividend Kings videos. Anyway, guys, first things first, I want to say thank you for joining us today. If you don't know who I am, I'm Michael Romero, small time YouTuber, small time investor, just trying to do some big things and uh, take you guys on the journey with me. Hopefully you learn from my mistakes and you learn from my uh, wins. You know what I mean? It's all about helping. That's, I'm here to add value to your life or at least try to. And yes, I finally did get a haircut. <laughs> so feeling a little bit better. So yeah, real quick again, shameless plug, if you want to be a part of the Discord chat I'm in called Investing with Homies. I'll leave a link in the top pinned comment. If you wanna join, it's absolutely free. It's a growing community of investors. We're there to teach, we're there to learn. I'm a mentor in it as well. There's three other mentors in there. You can reach me and the other three directly. Uh, all you gotta do is click the link, go to it. Um, and whenever you sign up, like I said, it's free. All you have to do is go to the start here section of the discord, introduce yourself. You become a tier one homie and, uh, we'll, we'll take it from there. And hopefully, you know, we build this wealth together and that's the idea anyway. So yeah, top pin comment. If you want to join the investor with homies discord. So the first dividend King we have is genuine parts. And over the last year, of course it's down 22%. So it was trading at $77. Now it is currently trading at around, no, I'm sorry. It was trading at over hundred dollars. Now it's trading at $77. Is it a good buy? Maybe so. Uh, you'd have to do your due diligence because like I said in my previous video, I'm not a licensed professional. So you should not take this as advice. This is purely for education and entertainment purposes. So yeah, market cap of 11 billion. So Genuine Parts is a consumer cyclical company. Its, P, its, its dividend yield is 4.09% uh, annually. Its annualized payout is $3.16 or 79 cents per payout, you know, per quarter. Payout ratio is 75.24%, is uh, which is in the safe zone in my opinion. As you guys know, Anything under 100, they're paying less than you make. Anything over 100, they're paying more than they make. If they're paying 100, then they are paying exactly how much they make. It has consecutively grown its dividend over the past 63 years. And this is a major player that you wanna look at. Like you wanna see how often it grows its dividend. So yeah, its dividend growth is definitely something you want to look at, meaning, so if, if last quarter it paid 79 cents, this quarter it'll pay 80 cents or 81 cents or whatever. You wanna see that growth over time and its annualized growth is over the last year 3.61 percent and over the past three years uh 5.38 percent which is relative it's yeah, that's pretty good that's a decent amount over the past year or two uh over the past year or three and its next dividend payment is july 1st now the next dividend king we have is cincinnati Cincinnati is, I don't know where that came from, Cincinnati uh, Financials. Ticket symbol CINF and it is a financial, it's a bank stock. So as you can see here, over the past year, it is down 42%. So it was trading at around 120, 115 bucks, something like that. <clears throat> is it a good buy? Maybe you need to do your due diligence to see. PE ratio 181, that is uh, crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know uh, what's going on there. But dividend yield is 4.18%. Okay, 4.18%. You know, the magical number is 4% for a dividend yield. If you don't know why, leave a comment below asking me why, and I will make a 
video about it if you do not uh, know why 4% is a great return for dividends. Anyway, the annualized payout is $2.40 or $0.60 cents per payment, you know, per quarter. Um, the payout ratio is 69.97%, which is again, falls in the safe zone. Dividend growth, uh, it's grown its dividend consecutively for the past 59 years, which is the smallest on this list. The annualized growth for the last year is 7.14% and three years, is, the last three years is 6.27%. Now, the next dividend payment is July 15th. All right, guys, now next here we have Emerson Electric Company, ticker symbol EMR. Over the past year, it is down just 12%, was trading around $77. Now it was tr it's trading at around $55. Um, dividend yield is 3.5%, which is still good. 3.56%, um, which isn't too bad. $33 billion market cap, which is re pretty decent, and PE ratio of 16 now, the annualized payout is $2. So for every one share you own of EMR, you will get paid $2 a year, or you get paid 50 cents per payment, per, you know, per payment, meaning every quarter. Um, the payout ratio is 67.66%, which is in the safe zone, so that's a good thing. Uh, and the dividend growth, it, it's grown its dividends consecutively for 63 years. The annualized growth, well, for the last one year is 1.52%, and for the last three years is 1.28%. So it's not that, um, it hasn't been growing its dividends that much, but it is growing its dividends. So that's another thing you want to look for. Like, is this a company? Yeah, it may have been growing its dividends for quite a long time, but if it's growing just a little bit um, each year. So that is something else to look at and keep in mind when you are looking for a dividend uh, king stock. Now its next dividend payment is June 6th. So, and this is in the industrial sector. I don't know if I said that yet or not. <laughs> so, so guys, next we have American States Water, ticker symbol AWR. And this is in the utilities sector. So again, why do we pick four different sectors? Because we want diversification. We don't want all of our eggs in one basket because we know if that sector slumps, we're pretty much screwed. <laughs> so yeah, that's why you want diversification, especially in a dividend portfolio. Really any portfolio, but especially in a dividend portfolio. Because if one sector starts to cut their dividends more than others and you're in that one sector, your portfolio is pretty much trash. Anyway, over the past year, it is up actually 7%. So that's pretty good. Over the past three months though, we're down 10%. So it was trading at around $92 was its high. Right now it's trading around $79. So is it at a cheap place to buy? Let's find out and see. With a dividend yield of 1.53%, 1.56%, I'm sorry. A market cap, market cap of two billion and a PE ratio of 34. Wow, that is, uh, its annualized payout is $1.22 per share per year, or 30 cents a share per payment. So, for owning one share of this, you'll get $1.22 a year, and 20 cents, I'm sorry, and it, you'll get that over 30 cent payments over four quarters. Payout ratio is 53.75%, which is by far the safest uh, payout ratio of these four. The dividend growth is 65 years, which is pretty decent. Now the annualized growth of the last year is 5.7%, which is good. And over the last three years is 7.7%, which is phenomenal. That's really good. And its next dividend payment is June 1st. So really and truthfully, this is a lot of the information you would wanna look at when looking beginning to look for a dividend stock. There's a lot more you need to look at. Balance sheets, income statements, um, future of the company, all that. So yeah, um, this is just a little insight into what is going on with these companies. These are four dividend kings. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you made it this far, go ahead and smash that thumbs up button for the YouTube algorithm because it helps this, this channel more than you guys know. Um, and also if you made it this far and you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and 
hit that little red button turning it great as you can see here we have a board subs growth goal let's get to a thousand um i think we'll do it within the next uh two months well within the next month so i'm ready for it guys let's hit that thousand anyway look wait anyway, look also if we get 50 likes within the first three days of me posting this i'll make a third video on dividend kings um anyway guys look hope you enjoyed this video um, if you want to continue your journey to financial enlightenment with me, go ahead and click on one of these videos. I'm going to get out of here, guys. Have a good day. Um, y'all stay safe out there and y'all stay collecting them dividends. Y'all have a good day.